Good morning, students. It's Miss St. John. I'm live from my house, Windy Hill Mill Farm, and I wanted to show you what my mornings look like. Now, I've already started my morning because I already have um, sent my husband off to work, and I have washed a load of clothes and already hung them on the line, and I've cooked my son breakfast, but now it's time to start the outside chores. Um, you'll see Briar in just a minute, one of my dogs running around, but we have chickens waiting, other dogs waiting to be fed, and mules waiting to be checked on. So walk with me as we walk to the barn. Good morning. Come on, Briar. This is Briar. She's our youngest dog. She is a coon dog, and she's very timid. She loves to run in the woods, but... She doesn't really know much about coons. In fact, I think if she saw a live coon, it would scare her to death. But she is a sweetheart and she greets us every morning when we come out, just as soon as we come out of the house. This morning, she met me at the clothesline. We're gonna go through the gate and we're gonna go through a cut through that my husband made me because I found it. One day when I was online, I got tired of opening up this long gate. So I found this cut through and he got home and I said, look, can you build this? And him and Clay, this is what they built me. We built this when we had donkeys and um, they used to stay in this pen and they were bad to want to wander out. And they could not get through that little Z or V shape. So let's make our way to the barn and say good morning to our other three dogs, Mouse, Blue, and Tubby. It will be a little chaotic for just a few minutes because they're really excited to get their day started, but you will enjoy it. chickens. We've had chickens in the past, but we've gotten rid of them. And uh, we got four hens, four laying hens, and one game chicken. I think you may get to see them all. Look over there, the, the smaller one, that's the game hen. And then we have three red and then the black chicken. And she's my favorite. She has green. Look at the colors in her. There's green, blue, red, black. 
I think she's gorgeous. She's probably my best, my favorite color. We come down every morning and check them. Feed them. Check their water. And um, I want to make sure there's not any snakes in the chicken coop. Because it's not uncommon for the snakes to want to eat the eggs. And it's quite alarming to catch a snake out here. So let's walk back through the barn. Let me get my treats and we'll go check on the mule. Some treats and let's go to the pasture and check on the moon. You can go, man. This is the pasture behind the barn. We have four meals in this pasture. Let's go over in over here. This is a high pencil fence and it has electricity on it. morning so I'm gonna slip under it this is Ruby Ruby is a molly mule she's waiting for her morning treat molly means she is a girl these three mules over here come on Earl <coughs> come on Earl come on Earl we've got Earl Cassie and Fancy. Earl is a John Mule. Let's see if I can lure him over here with the tree. This is Fancy with the white nose. She's a molly mule. And when you feed a treat, you'll want to make sure your hand's flat and your thumb is tucked because you can see they nibble. This is Cassie. She's another molly. She's a girl. And this is Earl. Earl has been here the longest out of the mules in this pasture. He's a John mule, a boy. And um, he's one of my favorites. And he, uh, my husband's who normally rides him. And they can smell the treats in my pockets. See how they're nibbling? Let's, let me show you. The reason you want to be careful when they're nibbling is they have very big teeth. Let me show you what the teeth look like. This is Cassie. Look at those teeth. All right. Let's go to the next pasture. Did you hear Briar? Let me slip out in the next pasture is where you'll find my mule, Daisy, and our family mule, which is Belle, who has been with us for 19 years. We bought her when our children were five and three. Something that's interesting about a mule, if you remember, I told you they were hybrids. That means mules do not reproduce. And another interesting fact that I think is interesting, you know how we're measured in, in inches? Like I'm five foot nine inches tall. A mule is measured in hands, your hand. And it's measured in increments of four. All the mules we have here are over 14 hands which for you mathematicians mean you take 14 times it by four, and that's how many inches they are. But it goes up like this, 14 one, that means 14 hands 
one inch, 14 two, 14 three, and then you go to 15 hands. And I believe all of our mules range from 14 hands to 15 three hands. Let's see if we can holler and if they'll come up and tell us good morning. We have one in here who likes to be turned out every day. Daisy! Come on, Daisy! Notice who I call the gray dapple. She's mine. There's five mules in this pasture. The one in the front, the gray dapple. That's Daisy. That's my mule. She's a Molly. And then the mule behind her is Belle. She's an Appaloosa Molly mule. That's the family mule. And then right now, Buddy is behind Belle. He's the third mule. He's a John mule. And then Zeke, the red sorrel mule, he's the one who I'm going to turn out. You'll get to watch him. And then May is the last one, the sorrel molly mule. And that's who my son Clay rides. But Daisy's coming up this morning just to wish me good morning and to get her morning treat. And sometimes the other mules can't get around me because she, she's a little piggy and wants all the treats in my pocket. Good morning, Daisy. See her big, pretty long ear? Good morning, baby. Come on, buddy. And she may want them all because I always seem to give her extra. Good morning, buddy. Good morning, Good morning, Zeke. Bill. Let's turn Zeke out. He's waiting patiently. When I'm at home, I turn him out every morning and he um, picks in the barn lot. He's just special here. Let me get my gate lock back. I have one more to see me. Seems to be the slow poke this morning. Good morning, May. May is probably, you can see the height difference. May's about 15 1, 15 2 hands, and Belle's about 14 hands. Right here with Daisy. Look how they lay their ears back. That means they're fussing at each other without saying any words. Let's see. You ready for another treat, buddy? Buddy is the mule I was riding. When I videoed for you, Buddy is who I was riding, and Ruby over there, the mule in the front, the first mule we saw, she's who I, uh, my daughter was riding when I videoed for you. Well, I hope you enjoyed my day on the farm. This is how I start my morning, every morning. Even when we're going to school, sometimes I have to come out and do this in the dark. Um, this is just a morning. This is a daily chore for me that I enjoy. It's what I chose to do. I hope you have a wonderful day. I miss you. I look forward to seeing you again.